Hey everyone, this is Ariel Royalty and we are back for Let's Play Skyrim episode 36. Last time we cleared out Ironbind Barrow and started to make our way back to the college which was really slow. And you may notice I'm in a different location. I'm actually at the stables of Wind Windhelm because we're going to buy a new horse and then go to the college. So I did that off screen. I didn't actually fight anything or gain any experience, thankfully. But it is what time? Too early to buy a horse, that's for sure. Come on, stables. Horse sooner? Where's the guy we buy horses from? I do hear voices. Ah, Kashi Caravan. Madran, you're the one who spoke to Yazolda. Uh, Come, come and see what goods I offer. I welcome you, friend. How may I serve you? Quite the opposite, in fact. The soldiers are some of our best customers, for we offer supplies and wares they cannot obtain by other means. It was Rissad's idea to come here now, while the land is in turmoil, where others saw only danger, he saw opportunity. He hired the others and paid for my goods. I am allowed to run the caravan, but I pay Risa the percentage of my profits. I say this without bitterness, for it was Risa who saved me from a life of servitude aboard a trading ship. I am grateful to have the life that I do now. It is a far cry from my days as an orphan on the streets of Corinth. I guess that's a city in elsewhere. Take a look. Okay. Let's see what you got. Not much that I need at the moment, but some healing potions would be nice. Speaking of healing. should fetch him a good price at least. That should help. May your road lead you to warm sands. Fifty. Okay. Maybe they're in here. We need to stop my timer. I love my husband, but he can be a bit dull at times. Okay, they're not in here. That sucks. There he is. Come on, I want a horse.
a way to get ahead of you. I hope someday we'll get to know each other better. It's for sale if you've got the coin. That's your best offer? I suppose so. She's the one with the saddle. My pa used to say, there ain't no use worrying about the things you can't change. If it's my fate to be ended by a dragon, so be it. Meantime, I'll live my life the way I want to. Fair enough. Sometimes the difference between life and death is a swift steed. Okay, we have a mount. That means we can fast travel. Okay, first things first. Enfer! It's about the only guy I trust to sell stuff to in the college. And apparently we can ride our horse into the college. I couldn't even ride my bike into school! Then again, my school was kind of stuck up. Uh, why is she walking like that? I need your help with something, something private. The chanting services are one of the few things that keep us in touch with the rest well, of Scotland. Well, you are certainly making a name for yourself. There are few places where one can pursue my type of work without fear of persecution. Okay, not sure why they're walking like that. No matter. Of attainment. Let's see if he's in here. Now, if I remember correctly, his room's on the second floor. And Ayla's carrying a torch. Okay, where's the dude? Where's the dude? There's the dude. Even with the colleges, <coughs> there are some exper- I hope you've got some coin. Well, uh, let's just take a look then. Good. I'm not going to ask why you're selling them. But I am interested in your soul gems. He's broke. Till next time. Ah, ah. And I got an itch on my back. That ain't fun. So I think this episode will be a bit more, well, laid back for one. So this should be my bed.
Okay. T, that's what I need. Okay. Three AM, four, five, six, seven. Sure. Well, you're certainly making a name for yourself. Yeah, it's called dedication. Even there are some. Ex I hope you've got some. Uh, let's just take a look then. He should have restocked, so we were selling him weapons, weren't we? I'm keeping that. Till next time. <laughs> Who are you? I'm working on some very important research, I assure you. I think the college is due for a change in leadership. Urag can be very helpful. Just don't antagonize him. Can you... can you possibly help Cesargo? It is difficult to admit, but Cesargo could still use some help. Mages in Cyrodiil are all about politics. The Synod and the College of Whispers are too busy guarding secrets to bother to teach. Skyrim was not Cesargo's first choice, but Winterhold is removed from politics. Dedicated to study, this is the place for Cesargo to become great. Fair enough, what do you want? Jezargo has seen that Torfdir likes you. You must be very skilled with magic, yes? Jezargo is working hard, but cannot do it alone. Can you help with this? Jezargo has worked hard on learning new spells, trying new things. This will make Jezargo stand out as a mage. But Jezargo works so hard, there is no time to test these new spells. If you help with the testing, this will make learning easier. Jezargo will give you scrolls. You will use them and report the results. <clears throat> this is a good plan, no? You tell Jezargo when you are ready. <laughs> you can resist. Let's see. This one, I think. 
Cesargo has designed it to be an excellent flame cloak, with a twist. It is especially potent against the undead, and should burn them to a crisp in no time. Cesargo gives you plenty of these scrolls, so you try them and return when you can say whether they work. Cesargo awaits word of how well his scrolls work. No one in here, probably because it's my room. I need to keep track of whose room is whose. I no idea who sleeps here. If you have a moment, could you help me with something? Until next time. Okay, I'm gonna do her, but... We're going to speak to him first. We shouldn't have been disturbing Sarthal, no matter what you found down there. Not at all. I consider it a blessing. My family was convinced coming here was a death sentence, or worse. It took years of insisting that this is what I'm meant to do. Yes, but it needs to be kept quiet. I may have entered into an agreement with Enther. He had something I needed, so I traded him something of mine. It was a mistake, and now I want back what I gave him. It's an amulet that belonged to my family, and I never should have given it to Enther. But he won't deal with me. Talk to him. See what it'll take to get my amulet back. It doesn't matter. It's also none of your concern. Just talk to him. See if you can convince him to give my amulet back. I told you it's for my family. I don't... I know they've always disapproved of what I wanted in life. To learn magic instead of becoming a farmer or a hunter. But no matter how poorly they may have treated me, they're still my family. I didn't consider that until after I made the trade. All right, then. I still need some help, if you can spare the time. Didn't you know? Before the Oblivion Crisis, many elves called Winterhold their home. More visited the college from Morrowind every year. After, growing distrust of magic made life difficult for many. Some left rather than endure the growing hatred from the local Nords. Others returned home after the Red Year, when Vardenfell erupted and caused much destruction. Winterhold itself died in the years between then and now. What's left out there is a husk. Only the college really remains. So far, if only because no one is telling me how great I ought to be, I just want to learn. I don't want to think about what's expected of me. We're all trying to become better mages, right? Well, I need someone I can practice a few spells on. Nothing dangerous, really. Would you be willing to assist me? Oh, good. I was afraid I'd have to go ask Shizargo. Now, you just stand there. Please hold still, and don't move. There! Now I... Oh dear. That wasn't supposed to happen. Do you... Do you feel alright? You look very... Um... Green. I am so very sorry. I went over this again and again, and I was sure it would have better results. It's not. It shouldn't be. You'll be back to normal in no time. And when you are, we can try this again, and I'll be sure to get it right. <laughs> yeah. So we gotta put up with this green haze. <coughs> okay. Ten. Mm. I take it that's the sound of the spell wearing off.
Yup. Okay, that's 10 a.m. 9, 8, 7. Roughly. Where is my pen? I had a pen. Where'd I put it? I had it yesterday. There it is. <clears throat> okay, we've done hitting the books pretty much. I understand you're the one that found this orb in Sarthol. At least something good came out of that trip to Sarthol. I didn't find anything but dust. Exactly as I said it would. Now, are you ready to try again? I am confident it will work this time. This will be worth it. Okay, now don't move at all. That isn't right. Just wait. Just... I can fix this. Oh no. That's not good. Let me try again. This really isn't turning out the way I do. I'll get it right this time. I swear. There. All better. Well, it all worked out in the end, didn't it? Oh, no, it hasn't. Let's be honest. I have a long way to go before I'm ready for the kind of advanced magic I've been attempting. But at least I know where to start now. Thank you. You've been a great help to me. Okay. All right, then. Not that I care for a necklace of waning magic. Who's humming? Urag can be very helpful. Just don't antagonize him. Eve, there are some experiments the college fra- I hope you've got some. Uh, let's just take a look then. Precious. Onmund is too afraid to deal with me himself, and so he sent you. I'll make this very simple for you. All so there's nothing more to be said. Look how persistent you are. Charming, really. Onmund gave up the first time I said no, but not you. All right tell you a little story. Let's pretend for a moment that a certain individual was looking to acquire a particular staff. Let's also pretend that he traded some valuable items for said staff. And it was only later that it was realized that this individual might... The resulting disaster would reflect quite poorly on every... You're not very good at this, are you? Look, I traded a staff to someone and found out later that was a bad idea, so I'd like the staff back. Understand? Finally, we... I look forward to having it back soon. The sooner the better, in fact. Okay. All right, then.
Apollo? Nara. It's lies. All of it. I don't care what she told you. It's all lies. No? Well, then she hasn't gotten to you yet. But she will. And don't you believe a word of it. Don't trust that one. He's up to something. Most here are up to something, of course, but in his case, it's not good. I haven't figured it out yet, but I will. He is rather handsome, though, isn't he? Eh. My problem with her? She's the one who has a problem with me. She's threatened by me, by my skill as a wizard, by my elegance and posture, by my superior good looks. But she is not going to get the better of me. Oh no, I won't let it get to me one bit. That's what she's after. She's trying to undermine my confidence, make me doubt myself. Well, it won't work, I tell you. Okay. Until next time. You're on your game, who I don't want to talk to at the minute. Okay, I'm going to see if I can find the other teachers. I hear a dragon. Ayla.
Kayla? Shelter behind the I just wanted to see if magic would cause the statue to do something. Land your big buffoon!
you didn't know if there was going to be any action, well, here's your action. I'm putting on health because I can't see how much magic I got. Probably because I'm wearing something that boosts magic. Okay, where am I going to put this skill boy? on file. Okay. My horse okay. Yes it is. Just about. Yeah, maybe you helped out in five. some action at least. Okay. Just had this USB thing for my mic leaning on my leg and it's left a nice outline. Enchanting services are one of the few things that keep us in touch with the rest of Skyrim. Well, there's alchemy. Okay, no one's here. I say where are the others, but there's one. <coughs> no one in this room. Mirabel does a fine job as Master Wizard, I suppose. Spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Sorry. <laughs> All right. I can't. Spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them.
Until next time. Okay. Seriously, is no one around at the moment? I must have sunk on Adept to be able to get the Adept robes. Okay, walking is a pain in the butt. Urag can be very helpful. Just don't antagonize him. Yeah, Arabelle, well, Arabelle. you're certainly making a name for yourself. Let's see the Arcanium we can hand in the books as we go, maybe. I haven't decided yet. All I know is, when we hand them in, the next quest will start, and I'm not sure I want to start it just yet. Are you looking for any specific volumes, Travis? Hmm? Oh, oh no, no. 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 Not really. I... actually, I've forgotten what I was looking for. Ah, uh, well then. Let me know if you need anything. What's that? Oh, yes, yes, thank you. I will. You know, they say knowledge is its... Take a look. Restoration is a perfect. You consider restoration a valid school of magic, worthy of study, don't you? Don't you? Good, good. Not that I require validation, of course. There are just some, and I shan't name names, who would disagree. It can make life difficult when one's colleagues fail to recognize the research one engages in. Take a look. Well, no, not really. Not directly, I mean. But I know things are being said behind my back. Conversations cease when I enter rooms. I'm quite aware of what's going on here, and I will not stand for it. All right, then. Looks like Enfear is our best bet for selling stuff. Illusion, really, is the least appreciated of the schools of magic. Once again, I have found very insulting notes left in my purse. Just because I don't fit in here is no... Okay. Urag can be very helpful. 
Just don't antagonize him. Entertainment. There are some ex I hope you've got them. Well, let's, let's just take a look, look then. then. You don't have any gold. Till next time. Anyway, that is going to be it for this episode. In the next episode, we will continue selling stuff. And... Hopefully, we'll be able to sell everything and get started on the next quest. So until then, take care of yourselves and I will see you next time. Goodbye.